Hi guys, this is a Carol diagram, which you're going to have a go at using. You can make your own, but I've printed one out that's done for me. So it's got four boxes and then two no legs, has legs, has fur, doesn't have fur. So you can see that they're opposites, each one. And what we do is we take an animal. So I've printed my animals out, but you might want to draw a picture. You could write their name. If you have a printer, you could print the pictures out yourself and cut them out. And I'm going to sort them and put them into the right box. So the butterfly, I can see in the picture and I know already that they have legs. So I'm going to put it underneath has legs. But now I need to check whether it has fur or doesn't have fur. And the butterfly doesn't. So I move it down to this box. Next up I've got a fox. So I know it has legs and it has fur. So I put it in the right box. Let's do a couple more. I've got a robin now. Hmm, I can see it's got legs. But I need to think if it has fur. It's a bird, so actually it has feathers. So I'm going to move it down to the no fur box. And let me do one more. Okay, I've got a fish. So a fish has fins, but doesn't have legs. And it's got scales, not fur. So can you see I've put it in the right place? And there are loads more pictures on the sheet that I could have a go at. Now it's up to you, you can try and make your own carol diagram with these same categories, or perhaps you can have a go at some different ones. You could do has, fins, no fins, or scales, no scales, for example. But give it a go and see how you get on.